Hi, my name is Steve Owens. I'm a fisheries biologist with the Department of Game and Inland Fisheries. I work in far southwest Virginia, the Marion Regional Office. Um, today we're on the banks of the South Fork of the Holston River, which is uh, um, a premier trout stream located in uh, Smith and Washington counties, Virginia. Uh, it's a unique uh, watershed in that we have trout habitat from uh, Sugar Grove, and uh, it extends about 30 miles to the headwaters of South Holston Lake. Okay, so today we're on the South Fork Holston River here at the Buller Fish Hatchery and we're conducting an annual fish population survey. Um, we try to get out uh, in the middle of the summer, usually early July, and look at a lot of our trout streams throughout the area, just look at overall population numbers, look at trends, fish health. And what we're doing today is using uh, backpack electrofishing gear. We're able to put a, a mild electric current in the water, we're able to collect these trout, and uh, it allows us an opportunity to get links and weight. Uh, today we'll also have our state veterinarian on site doing some wild fish health uh, monitoring and when we get done we're able to release the fish back in the wild for anglers to pursue another day. Okay, so as a trout angler, there's a, a number of different options for recreational opportunities on the South Fork of the Holston River. We have two special regulation areas. One is a two fish over 16 inch uh, single hook artificial lure only uh, regulation. And then we also have a catch and release uh, section uh, single hook artificial lures only uh, that is found at the Buller uh, Fish Hatchery. That section of the river, we've been able to uh, develop it into a, a trophy fishery through the use of supplemental feeding. Uh, it is primarily wild fish that are found in that section, uh, mostly wild rainbow trout, uh, a few brown trout, um, but in order to capitalize on uh, uh, increasing productivity, we, we do do some uh, some feeding on a daily basis. It's allowed uh, rainbow trout to grow up to uh, four or five pounds and we've gotten some brown trout uh, in the seven, eight, nine pound range. And uh, we've been able to really provide the opportunity for anglers in this area to catch a much larger trout than they typically would find in most of our wild trout streams that are occupied mostly by fish less than nine or ten inches in length. I'd like to encourage folks, uh, come visit Southwest Virginia. We have phenomenal trout fishing. Um, there's opportunities to fish for trout throughout the summer. We've got good flows and, uh, and uh, good populations of both wild fish and hatchery fish that uh, folks can pursue. So come on down to Southwest Virginia and, and, and enjoy yourself.